Hello friends, welcome to ANSI's tutor. In this video, we would see how you could add data file quantities in the ANSI's Fluent Solver setup. First of all, let's know what is data file quantities and why it's used. There are some standard data file quantities that are available for CFD post-processing results. There are some default output properties data in ANSI's results like wall velocity, density, wall temperature etc. Apart from these standard default results, there are some other necessary parameters which can be obtained from the simulation results like Y plus value, Reynolds number, strain rate etc. For simplicity, the solver only saves some of the important and required standard quantities for the simulation. These parameters are listed in the additional data file quantities. So after selecting the additional parameter, the data file for that result would be recorded and would be saved along with the default results. These can be used to obtain the CFD output results after the simulation gets completed. Some users reported that they are unable to use the data file quantities option in the new student version, so in this video, we will see the various ways to enable the data file quantities option. This is ANSI's software version 2020 R1. In this version after initializing the data file quantities option gets activated. For this go to the file menu and select data file quantities. There is another way to get the data file quantities option. Go to the run calculation page and select data file quantities on this page. In the newer ANSI's 2022 version, this file menu option is not working even after initialization. These data files can be added in the Run Calculation page. There is another method to enable the data file quantities option in the file menu. For this, go to the file menu and select preferences option. Go to general preferences, select default format for input output operations and change it to legacy. Click on OK. Now you can able to see the data file quantities option active in the file menu. Hope this information will be helpful to you. Please like share and comment. Thank you.